So this is a quick video to give you a little bit of an understanding for how you're supposed to get your measurements off of these parallax images. So there was a few videos that showed the, the setup and the concept of parallax and then I took a series of images with the stand at different distances and from the right side and the left side. This particular image is the 50 centimeter which is your stand position and the left side and in the zoomed out you can actually see that we're looking from the left side stick. You can't quite read on here although if you were to zoom in you can kind of a, a little bit um, see where you're at but I don't expect you to read that. Instead where you need to zoom in is up here at the top and you might have to scroll around a little bit so the meter ruler over here is showing you your measurements and they're a little blurry but I've got 40, you got 50, you got 60. You can't see 70 but it's kind of behind the sticks and then you got 80 over here. And then the close up stick and the target stick are lined up with each other. Now you're not going to be able to see an exact number here but you're going to estimate. And again, they're a little blurry, but if you count, that can help you. You got 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68 is kind of at the edge on here. And then there would probably be a 69 and a 70, and then probably a 71, 72. So you're going to estimate and somewhere in here between 68 and 71 is going to be the measurement you're going to use for the left side position. Now I would probably estimate this one at about 69, but 70 would probably be an okay value too. There's a range of values I'll accept for each image. So when you look at each one of these images, and again this is the instructor view, yours will look a little different. You click on each one of those images, which are high resolution images, and then you can zoom in to get an estimate for where the stick is crossing the ruler. Those are the measurements you're going to use. I'm not going to do every one of them for you. If you have any issues zooming in, looking at the images, or understanding what you're seeing, please contact me.